Hey, Math 31, I had a question coming out of section 7.1, number 77. And here we're talking about admission into an amusement park. And we see that four kids and two adults total out to $116.90. But if you have six kids and three adults, it's a little bit higher, which it should be. You have more folks going. It's $175.35. And, and ultimately, they want us to figure out the price of a child's ticket and the price of an adult ticket. So I'm going to call that X and Y and set up my two systems of equations. Or not two systems, my system of two equations. So I have... Four children plus two adults is $116.19, and then six children and three adults is 175.35. And if I look at that system of equations, something I notice is none of these numbers have opposite signs, right? Both X terms are positive, both Y terms are positive, and none of them have coefficients of one, which, okay, so then it's just up to me what I want to multiply by. And I opted to say, hey, you know what, let me try and eliminate the X variable just because, and you could have just as easily done the y, but if I wanna do that, I see it as, if I multiply this one by negative three and this one by positive two, then I'm gonna ultimately have, I'll, I'll here have a negative 12x on top and a 12x on the bottom. So that's gonna allow me to eliminate. So that's what you see me doing over here. But the, the thing that I wind up um, seeing is that, yeah, when I multiply this top equation by negative 3 and I multiply that bottom equation by positive 2, I actually get a dependent system, right? Again, we arrive at something that is always true. 0 is always equal to 0. So I have a dependent system. And that means I have infinitely many solutions. Oh, and actually I wrote it here, infinitely many solutions. So then all I need to do to actually get my answer in uh, correct format is pick one of these equations and solve for y, or, or solve for x, but I'm going to solve for y. So I just picked that one. And I could have picked any of these. I could have picked this one. I could have picked this one. I could have picked this one. But I, I opted to pick this one. I solved for y, and, and there it is. y is equal to negative 2x plus 5845. So I have my dependent system. And whatever you decide the price of that child's ticket is, if you have the adult ticket be the um, expression negative 2x plus 5845, you're going to get a, a solution to your system. All right. Thanks so much. Bye.